Hi everyone, welcome to Techie Review. Today's video is an update to a video I did back in July 2014 on how to resize your Windows partition or your Windows Boot Camp by taking space from your Mac OS and reallocating it into Windows. Now in this video, I've updated it to show that the method still works for Catalina and still using free tools. So without further ado, let's dive in. So the first thing we need to do is make sure that anything important has been backed up both on your Windows Bootcamp side and also your Mac OS. Make sure it's backed up before we start anything, please. So the first thing we need to do is go into Disk Utility and this is where we're going to partition our space. Now, I don't know if this helps or not, but it might be just be worthwhile, worthwhile running the first day just to make sure that everything and the file permissions are all okay on your Mac partition. No idea if it helps or not, and it's optional whether you want to go ahead and run that. Now we're going to actually partition our hard disk space. So if we go into partition, this has changed a little bit. If we go into partition again, that's where we can see our Mac OS and our bootcamp partitions. And what we're going to do is this is where we're going to resize it. So we just click on the plus that allocates some default space and then we use, use the slider to move that space up or down but there is also at the side we can actually if you want to be very specific about the amount of space you want to use there is a little input box at the side where we can specify the exact amount once we've done that you can format it for, for whatever we like and we need to go and apply those changes And once those changes have completed, we're going to go and reboot into Windows. Once we restarted into Windows, we want to use the mini tool partition wizard. Now I'll leave links to, the, to that in the description below as a free download. Once we've installed that, we want to go to the disk and partition management. Now in here, we can obviously see our Mac OS partition. We can see other, which is what we've formatted as our free space and we can obviously see our bootcamp partition. Now if you go and delete that partition that's going to make it an allocated space. If we apply those changes and then once we've done this this is where we can merge and resize our bootcamp partition to use the new unallocated space as easy as that. Once we've done that again we want to go and apply those changes And this is where it's going to restart our, our Mac and we're going to see a screen very similar to this as it makes all the changes to our new bootcamp partition. Once that's done, your Mac will restart back into Windows. And if we check the mini tool partition wizard again, we're going to see that we've now got our new resized bootcamp partition with the extra space. Now this has all been done on Mac OS Catalina and the latest version of Windows and it's still working and the method is pretty much identical. Now if you've got any questions, any comments, please leave them in the comment section below and I'll do my best to answer. I hope you found this video useful. Please remember to like and subscribe. Thanks very much for watching and I will see you all next time.